tonight. It's a video that's gone viral. A woman accuses the Colorado Springs Police Department of police brutality. Now we're hearing from her tonight. Hospital surveillance video shows Alexis Acker being thrown to the ground by an officer two years ago. She plans to file a civil lawsuit against the police department. Caradio News Channel 13's Greg Miller is live from police headquarters. And Greg, she is not holding back tonight. <laughs> No, she's not, James and Heather. Now, police say they cannot comment on that video because it's part of an ongoing litigation and an internal investigation. The woman filing that suit against the department admits she mouthed off to cops, but she says their response went too far. I remember being escorted by Officer Walker to the double doors. Alexis Acker admits Walker. she made mistakes. I was mouthing off a little bit, saying some absurd words. But she says this was too far. Surveillance video in 2013 shows Acker in handcuffs when Officer Tyler Walker approached her. And he like brought me to like a chair and I stood before it and he told me to sit down and told him I didn't want to sit down and told me to sit down again and I told him I'm not sitting down. So he like pressed on my hip to make it buckle and then I sat down. That's like when I went back. That's when police say she kicked him in the groin. I very much so think he was too aggressive. Um, from the jump, he left bruises on my arms. She says his response left Acker covered in blood. Acker was charged with two counts of second degree assault. Documents show she took a plea deal, and those charges were dropped. She did plead to felony menacing and obstruction, but despite all of it, she still calls this. Police brutality. Like to sp like speak with law enforcement. It just kind of terrifies me a little bit. Um, it's hard for me to feel safe. I guess I just don't really know who I can turn to, who is safe, who is not. According to police reports, Officer Tyler Walker and other officers responded to a disturbance earlier that night where they found Acker intoxicated. Officer Walker is the son of former Deputy Chief of Police Rod Walker, who retired in 2012. That report also say that she kicked at two other officers. Reporting live in the Springs tonight, Greg Miller, KRDO News Channel 13. More to come there. Thanks.